What is genetic algorithm? Genetic algorithm is basically an optimization technique which is used to find maximum and minimum of a given problem. It may be constrained or unconstrained and main, mainly the, its motivation is from Darwin's theory of evolution. It, the main thing it, it is motivated is that in Darwin's theory of evolution, the best fit individual is picked up for the next generation and the characteristics of the best individual is picked up for the next generation. The main steps of genetic algorithm are populating the initial population, fitness function, natural selection, mating pool and crossover and mutation. So how do we initialize the population? So how do we initialize the initial population? Initial population is initialized randomly based on the constraints given in the question. If it is if it is unconstrained, then we have a wide range to cover. Then next comes fitness. Fitness is basically to optimize the problem. If it is maximum, we have to maximize the fitness function. And if it is minimum, we have to minimize the fitness function. So next is natural selection. Natural selection is basically done for the most fit individual. If, if, if the individual is most fit, then it is most probable for the natural selection. So mating pool. Uh, ne next text for natural selection mating pool uh, the selected individuals in natural selection are kept in the mating pool where the functions like crossover and mutation are there crossover is nothing but similar to reproduction both uh, characteristics of both parents are heritated by the offspring then what is mutation mutation is nothing but we are it, it is to get wide range of solutions Wide range, of, wide range of individuals so that it is not un, it is not untested. In mutation, a random behavior is picked up and changed randomly so that we get a wide range of solutions. What is symbolic regression? Symbolic regression is a type of regression analysis that searches the space of mathematical expression to find the model that best fits for the data set, given in terms of accuracy and simplicity. No particular model is provided as a starting point of, of the algorithm. Basically, symbolic regression uses evolutionary algorithms such as genetic algorithms to get the solution. So what is different in normal genetic algorithm and symbolic in the application of genetic genetic algorithm in symbolic regression? First and main thing is population type. Initial population type here is just an expression. If you consider an expression such as x square plus 2x, it can be break into a syntax tree such as plus can be the main nodal point and, and it can be split in this way. This is a syntax tree. This is taken as each individual as of the initial population. And error, error between the expected output and our individual is taken as a fitness function and which is to be minimized. And what is the output? The main advantage of symbolic regression is we get an expression as an output, which is very user friendly. Hello, what is iterator function? Consider a function f such that it maps onto pixels. This type of function can be even the range of this function can be used to generate another range. Such that consider an example of like this. If this is a second order iterator function, the value of f of x 
we use to find the range of this function. If it is recursively done, it is recursively done for n times. It is known as nth order iterated function. It is possible in the function when the when the domain and the codomain are the same, and it's an odd two function. Now we are solving iterated function of second order. That is of the type f of f of x equal to g of x. Now we we take input of both lower limit and upper limit, which is required for the task. This lower limit is upper limit is of x. So coming to the initial population, initial population is a 15 node tuple. 15 nodes are arranged in this way. These are the leaves. And these are considered as the root roots. All the list contains either the symbol x or any numerical value. The first node is fixed to x, in, and for the other node, x is taken with the probability of 0.25, and and for probability of 0.75, a random number is selected from 0 to 10, and it is fixed initialized here. And for the other other things, which are the root. Random operations are taken from functions and initialized to it. Those individuals are sent to number of iterations. In each iteration, in each iteration, the first function is fitness function. What is fitness function? Here, the fitness function is basically the absolute error between the original output, expected output g of x, and our individual from this tree. As it is to be minimized, we are using the function 1 by 1 plus log of 1 plus f of x, where f of x is the error between them. This is to be maximized now. Now, expected count. Expected count is fitness by the average of fitness. This from this, we find the probability. Probability is expected count by total number of individuals in the population. And this probability is used to find cumulative probability after, after each individual. Then, then we randomly choose a number between 0 to 1 and see where the number falls using the cumulative probability. Th those individuals are taken to taken and selected for the natural selection. From this natural selection, those which are selected are sent to the mating pool. Medical consists of individuals of the previous generation which are best fit for the given situation of GFX. It, it is selected number of times because of its high probability of the best fitness. In mating pool, the first step is the crossover. In our program, we have done crossover for 70% of the population. Crossover is nothing but we, we select we select any of the nodes from two individuals which are chosen randomly from the medic pool and then we swap the if we have selected this this node then the whole subtree is swapped between the two individuals this is done 75% times of the total population next comes the mutation we have, we have used 40% of the total individual population for mutation. In mutation, we choose a single individual randomly for 40% 40, 40 of the individuals. Then, we send it to a function named muta mutation where we randomly select these three kinds of mutation for it to undergo. First coming mutation operation gene. In mutation operation gene, we select one of the roots of the 
syntax tree and randomly change its operation thereby giving a new type new type of the solution then comes mutation for replacing the subtree here we select a random root and then we randomly generate the whole subtree below it as we have initialized in the initial population in similar way next next comes mutation swap subtree root mutation swap subtree root here here we select one of the roots and if we have selected this root then the subtree roots would be this thing this root did this would be swapped in between them so that it generates a, a new individual in them after all all this process the individuals are sent to the next generation and this total iteration is done to a number of times to get high accuracy in the problem all the iterations after each iteration we choose the max fitness in the iteration and we store the solution in a in an array or in a form of a string and at the last the max of the of all the individuals of all the iterations is the solution is the is produced as a solution for f of x finally we get f of x which forms g of x here